Hey y'all, it's me, Jacosta Lester. How you doing? This video is about some stuff. It's another um, set of insights that I've come to. Okay, I've arrived to. Yo, they try to erect a regime of stupid around you and in you in order to drive you into doing stupid with them. And then they try to keep themselves free of doing said stupidity so that they can appeal more to God against you. So, They'll try to drive you into particularly blasphemy. That particular sin, though understated, is probably one of the most destructive of them, in my opinion. Okay? So, put it like this. Jesus is the word of God. Your words, like Joyce Meyer said, are containers of power. Some, you put things forth in life depending on the strength of your words. They try to weaken the power of your words using you because they don't have power in and of themselves in order excuse me in order to establish themselves as powerful they try to render you powerless and demonstrate that particular enfeeblement and i don't know if that's a word right now anyway they try to demonstrate that you're enfeebled before others so that that implied power uh, becomes their own. They establish themselves as somehow powerful by rendering you powerless before an audience of potentially powerful people. Okay? So, what does that do? Well, they parasitically glean power of others. They they will wait on people to pray for them instead of you. They wait on things. They particularly try to manipulate people against you using the fact that they wreak havoc. Okay? So, all right. The regime works this way. Their men abuse their women who in turn abuse their children. Then, after they've done this, their children rule their women who rule their men. The compensatory action by all parties that see this stupidity, they overcompensate against all women men and children but in this order against the children against the women and against the men that also is part of the stupidity <laughs> so that there is the overcompensation they over uh, reprimand they over uh, chastise they over um, I'm trying to find the right word I'm struggling right now but basically they hold people more accountable than they should for the acts of others on the basis of those things that they've endured under them so repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand have a blessed and marvelous day and likewise they overcompensate in terms of uh, those allowances that they give people but they tend to uh, retract to take back favor from Christians who are born again and who know the Lord so that all in all they're going to beat you up favor the ones that are similar to you but throw you down before them it's what they are so repent for the kingdom of heaven is a hand have a blessed and marvelous day you guys take care that's the beast regime that I see around me it gets on my damn nerves and that's why I'm talking to you about it okay thanks bye